What's going on YouTube? Snipes here with TKO Gaming. Here we are on Firebase Duffy. I'm going to share with you guys how you guys can help your friends, help your family, help your best friend who has no thumbs get to the lighthouse. I'm talking about double carrying in Trials of Osiris. A lot of people claim to do it. I'm going to tell you guys how you guys can master it. Whether you're the best of the best or the worst of the worst, this will help you and I'll explain why in this video so please do stay tuned as you guys know every video we do a small giveaway for this video we're going to be doing 1000 silver promise you guys we got some bigger and better giveaways coming for you guys but for this video 1000 silver all you have to do is like this video comment down below did you make it to the lighthouse and if you did tell me how was it and if you didn't how close did you get and then make sure you subscribe to the channel you have to be a subscriber that's how we know all right and we do check so make sure you do that anyways let's get into this so you guys saw we won the first round in a double carry you want to be very very careful with how you approach your play style because a lot of people might have to change given the fact that you could be the best person in the game let's say 3v3 right you're the best person out of the six people in that game that means nothing in this game of destiny where you have grenades that track where you have bullshit kills where you have self res where you have stickies and all this crazy shit it just doesn't mean anything all right because individual skill can only get you so far a cohesive team will be the reason why you can win games and then go forth and make it to the lighthouse so what i say about that is i always recommend to have a sniper rifle as your best player why do I say that? Obviously, it wasn't a good representation. You guys saw me miss a couple shots, but honestly, guys, it's okay. Everybody misses. I'm not going to put every single game where I'm just the greatest player in the game. I could do that. Simple editing, I could do that. But I want to show you guys that even the best of the best players miss shots. Even the best of the best players don't do the best in the game. And it's okay because everyone has room to grow. Everyone can get better. And if you're a player, whether you're the best or worst, and you have that mentality, that is what will allow you to get better. Think about it for a second. If you had a mentality of, you know what, I'm the best, then you're not going to want anything to do with getting better at the game at all, right? So keep that in mind. So what I do with my teammates, whenever I do double carries or if I do double carries or if I see someone else do double carries and I have advice for them, I would always say is that you as a sniper, and please do be a good sniper, you want to make sure that you allow your team to get an orb down. If you can get a pick as a sniper on your team, that makes it so your teammates, let's say they're both, you know, no thumb, Timmy no thumbs, they can get to the orb. The good thing about Destiny is if you're a presence, like just that's a great example. I threw a grenade and as soon as I threw a grenade, the guy ran away, right? So that in a sense clears out a room. So in Destiny, essentially, just having a presence in a certain area or even popping up into, on someone's radar, it really can scare that individual off. And that's essentially what we do. When we get someone down, I want my teammates to get there as fast as possible. But train the people, you know, talk to them. Train them so they don't go and just die randomly. You know, just train them to get some shots in and then back off. If you're not going to win the gunfight, just back off. It's very important to know things like that and to train your teammates to work as a team, hound the other team, get together and then approach it in a team manner rather than, hey, solo running gun, I'm going to do what I do. Here, I advise my teammates to get different angles as I approach the middle angle. And look, we are all doing great here. We're getting our kills. And before you know it, the game is going to end. Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope this video does help you guys. Stay tuned for much more awesome videos, especially for the new patch. We're going to tell you guys the best weapons to use. Please, guys, make sure you subscribe. That's the best way to get to know us. And follow us on Twitter at RealTKO Gaming. We'll see you in the next one. Peace.